And by Arizona, he means Indiana. So <laughs> let's get that straight right off the bat. So Walmart, um, because going to Target requires a shower. That's, that's why we choose Walmart. We also choose Walmart because it's cheap therapy, okay? You're feeling down on yourself. You're not successful, you're not in shape, you don't look good. Go to Walmart. <laughs> Take a look around and you'll leave feeling much better about yourself. <laughs> right? I know. I'm uh, from a small town in Indiana. Let's reiterate that. And uh, it's Logansport, Indiana. You've never heard of it. Um, and uh, we just received one of the highest honors. We just got the second largest Walmart in the nation. Yeah! Now stop clapping, because it's not the largest. We're not that cool. Um, we never will be. Uh, <laughs> Being from a small town um, in Indiana, when I was moving to LA, everybody like questioned the move, you know, they were really involved. They were like, ask my mom, you know, aren't you a little nervous about Lauren moving to LA? And my mom, she'd answer the same way every time. She'd be like, oh no, if someone kidnapped Lauren, they'd probably drive down a few blocks and toss her back out. <laughs> Thanks, mom. Thanks. That's the, that's the family I come from. It's great. I actually just got back from Indiana, and I spent a lot of time with my sister and her three kids. So, thank you. You guys know what that means. Um, <laughs> hanging out with her was like hanging out with someone who has Tourette's, okay? Uh, <laughs> It was hard to get through a conversation with her, you know. She'd start out being like, you know, yeah, I had to pick the kids up from daycare, and Mason, sit down or you don't get any biscuits! <laughs> and yeah, then we had to stop by Dad's office, and say, hey, no popsicles for anyone! <laughs> How's LA? Like, she didn't even know, notice or like anything about the outburst. She just kept on going through every conversation we had. And like every time she'd yell, I'd be like, ah. And she'd just like, go on, you know what I mean? Just, just glide right through. I feel like moms get away with a lot of stuff if they're shouting it at their children, you know what I mean? Like at one point she said something like, all right, no one's going anywhere ever again. <laughs> it's like, the most empty threat ever, and all the kids are like, no, no, we're sorry, just tell us what we need to do. It's like, you guys, you have to go to school. You have to go somewhere eventually, like, calm down. It's so funny, I, I, it made me remember something my mom always used to tell me. She'd always be like, I brought you into this world and I can take you out of it. <sighs> yes, you guys have all got that one, right? <laughs> It's like, I don't know what that means. Um, exactly, she brought me into this world, but she, death? <laughs> Did my mom just give me a death threat? <laughs> 